Hello my lovelies and welcome back to my channel. As you can tell by the title, this is going to be a September monthly plan with me using my September monthly kit from my September mystery kit. Wow, <laughs> that's like a lot of September in that sentence. So here we are. This is my September mystery kit that was on sale for last month. It's all sold out now, so I'm sorry if you guys want to get your hands on it. It's all sold out. So with the monthly kit, you do have your header stickers, your title stickers, your sidebar stickers, some blank box stickers, um, paydays, functional stickers, so on and so forth, and your holidays, washi, and I'll also be using my freebie sticker with this month's spread. For those of you who are waiting for my new release video, I'll be uploading that right after this video here. Um, there will be some shop announcements also in that video, but I want to make this this video as a plan with me video and not talk about shop right so here you see that I kind of declutter my planner I took out from December till April look how thin it is and it's super light now like why did I not do this earlier <laughs> right so we are going to plan this month September well not this month we are still in August but next month September 2016 so let's get started So those of you who are new to my shop or to my design, I do layering effects for my monthly spread, meaning that my stickers are not really straight cuts as rectangles. Sometimes I like to add some overlap, not overlap, or just like the, 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 the picture will protrude out type of thing. So because of that, you have to put my sticker down in layers and by steps. So the first layer you put down are your blank boxes. As you can see here, that's what I'm doing. So here's an example of my stickers being calling protruding out. So it's not straight cut, like some parts of the image, I like to make it not 3D, but just sticks out to give it a nice effect to your page. I, I honestly don't know what word that is. If you guys do know, please comment down below because I don't even know how to explain it. So the second set of stickers that you want to put down is for your sidebar. I've included five different sidebar stickers where you guys have the option to play around with. You get two, uh, four long ones and one short one. So you'll be using two of the long ones and the short one to complete the sidebar. Or it's up to you, however you guys design or like to place your sidebar. So here I am, I'm gonna use my gold sidebar sticker with this shorter sticker here, which is just a basic blank box sticker. And I'm gonna top it or bottom it with a heart checkbox ombre checkbox list here so I'm going to show you also my title pages is that as you can see here that it's not straight it it protrudes <laughs> I really don't know what word to use but it's it's cut out it's a cutout of the image itself so that's why you need to layer it in different stages because I want you to have the sticker on the top is layer because of the cutout I think that's the right word <laughs> Next, I'm going to add in my holidays. So we have Labor Day, Patriot Day, and also first day of autumn. So your monthly kit will come with these washi strip, and I'm going to use these washi strip as an indicator of a, a event or a duration of an event. So here I am just marking off October monthly kit pre-sale. It's going to start on September 1st, and I've decided to have it run till um, the September 11th instead of the 4th because if it's, it's just four day pre-sale it's not fair for the other people so we're just gonna run it till the 11th so those of you who do not know my pre-sales are actually discounted price you get to place your order in at a discounted price plus free shipping if you decide to get my mystery kits after my reveal video it goes back to regular price and it's not free shipping so it'll be regular price plus shipping you will have to pay for shipping so here I'm just indicating some flags when it starts with the Etsy icon sticker and when will it end so with my monthly spread I like to view when I like to pay my bills not when I like to pay my bills but when my bills are due 
if it was up to me when I like to pay my bills, I'll never pay my bills. And also my paydays is going to be on Thursdays now. I like to also indicate my garbage and recycling because they do cycle throughout every other week. So this let me know which week is what garbage or recycling. Next on my list is my date nights. I have date nights every other Saturday and it's great to indicate it here on my monthly spread because then I can let my babysitter know when I need her for which dates. So on the 7th, it's my little girl's first day of preschools at a new school, so that's pretty exciting. So I'm just going to add a little banner just to celebrate it's her first day of school and a little check flag so that I know that it stands out a bit. So on the 4th, this whole long weekend, I have family visiting coming over and we'll be doing the CNE. So for those of you that don't know what CNE is, it's the Canadian National Exhibition. It's like a, a amusement park fair um, that we go to every year. So they have this every year for a whole month or so. I just printed and cut these little bed icon stickers just to indicate when I should change my sheets because I'm really bad at not changing sheets but remembering when or how often I change my sheets. So with this, I at least I could put it in my monthly view and I could see, oh, every two weeks I need to change my sheets. I know my husband was telling me like, people, normal people, <laughs> change their sheets once a week but that's me now. I'll be washing my sheets like every week and that's insane. So I think two weeks is good. Like how often do you guys change a sheet? Am I just insane changing it every two weeks? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> so I apologize that my frame is kind of blurry right now. So I just stuck down my hello uh, um, September sticker down. That's all you see. So here in my mystery kit, in the sneak peek, I forgot to tell you guys that this is an actual sticker that you could use in your planner. Instead of me just sticking it in there, I figured that you guys could use it. So for me, I usually would put it in this little blank box here just to remind me of next month's theme. And I think it's so cute, this little teepee. So I'm just gonna place it there. Once I have everything down, I'm going to start marking this with a black ink. However, my pen just died, so I'm just gonna use a Sharpie to do this. And then I just realized I forgot birthdays. How could I forget birthdays in September? So I have two birthdays in September, one on the 9th and one on the 1st. So on the 9th, I'm just gonna decorate it with some tassel, page flag, and a cake. And then with the 1st, because there's so many stuff going on on that day, I'm just gonna put it at that corner with a page flag and a cake. Because I have family coming down on the weekend, we'll be celebrating both their birthdays on that weekend. So that's why I put another cake there. And there you go, guys. I think that's it so far for what I know for September. But usually within the month, I would add a few more things in. So I hope you guys enjoyed this September plan with me using my September mystery kits not Mr. Kit, my September monthly kit where you could find it in my Mr. Kit. So for those of you who missed out for a September mystery kit, October mystery kit is on sale this Thursday, September 1st. So if you guys want to give it a try, try it out. Um, I'll be doing my new release video in my next video that I'll be uploading today. And I'm pretty sure everything will go on live either Tuesday or Wednesday. I'm going to show you guys also an Erin Condren version here. This is actually my mock-up that I've done I think a month ago before I cut these stickers out all for you because I do do a mock-up because I do need to know and see how the sticker fits, looks like and what I need to adjust so on and so forth. So this is how an Erin Condren will look like. It's very similar to the Happy Planner but yet it has its own difference. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this September plan with me video and I will see you in my next video. Happy planning, bye.